हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक सो विदाउट एनी डिले लेट स्टार्ट दी वीडियो इफ दैट इज हॉट स्टार्ट पीसीआर हियर द नेम इंडिकेटिंग हॉट स्टार्ट मींस वी जस्ट हीट अप द पीसीआर देन स्टार्ट मींस सिंपली यू कैन गेट द आइडिया फ्रॉम द दिस टाइटल दैट इज हॉट स्टार्ट सो व्हाट एग्जैक्टली द हॉट स्टार्ट पीसीआर सो जस्ट इमेजिन दैट when we add the tark polymerase in the beginning in pcr mixture and the first step as you know is the denaturation which usually done at the 94 degree and the tark polymerase it act at the 72 degree as the temperature rises it will you can say rise from 72 to 94 but as we know the tark polymerase can act at the 72 degree centigrade so as the temperature reach at the 72 so tark polymerase start acting before the denaturation step so that's why in this hot start pcr we simply inhibit the activation of this tark polymerase before the denaturation step so that the denaturation step completely done after that this tark polymerase gets activated so how we do this or what is the procedure of this stark polymerase will be covered in this next slide so here is the animation about this hot start pcr this is a pcr tube in which we have just added the target dna the dntps and buffer only missing is the stark polymerase now this is the stark polymerase so it is added at the lid of the pcr tube not in the buffer mixture but at the lid how like we just add the wax barrier between this pcr mixture and the tark polymerase so that the tark polymerase is not directly added to the pcr mixture so how we do this like in this animation we have the tark polymerase attached to the lid and there is a wax barrier between the tark polymerase and the pcr mixture now as we know this is the wax and wax they melt on heating so this is that wax which will melt as we add the additional heating step so after heating as the wax melt or you can say dissolve now because now the denaturation step has been completed and we are adding the additional step for just dissolving the wax so that now this tag polymerase can enter in this pcr mixture because the tark polymerase is very much important for the pcr so by this additional step now you can clearly see that the wax has been dissolved and the tark polymerase is now just inoculated inside the pcr mixture and now it will carry the normal pcr which can be checked by the agros gel electrophoresis so this is about the hot start pcr means why we are saying hot start because we are heating the pcr mixture after that the normal pcr cycle will start because the tark polymerase is only added after the additional heating step so that's why it named as hot start means first just heat up to dissolve the wax then the pcr will be started because the tark polymerase will be added after the wax will be dissolved so that's all for today guys see you in the next video thank you very much